Hey guys, welcome to the video and did you know that you are able to extract data from API into Microsoft Excel using the inbuilt Power Query features? CoinGecko API is completely free to use and you can enjoy the full compatibility without reading to code at all. Of course, I'll uh, the minimal coding is required which I'll be able to share to you. So by this video, you will be able to pull live price and build a portfolio of your favorite cryptocurrency directly into your very own Excel spreadsheet with a bit of elbow grease. So without further ado, let's dive into our computer screen and see how we can configure our API in our Excel sheet. A coin gecko api in our excel sheets hey guys so we are into in our computer screen and look at that the step by step uh, information is given in a coin gecko blog i'm not sure whether you guys uh, went through this steps but i'm going to explain this as well as i'm going to also configure the api in our excel sheet i'll show you here in live uh, this video and uh, of course if you have any challenges and you are not able to configure it i have my excel sheet which i've already configured it and i'm ready to share with you guys i will also share how you can obtain that excel sheet all right so you can see here uh, in excel sheet there uh, we need to go to data and from the from web uh, we through the api we have to pull out all the coin listed informations so when you come to uh, this uh, second step, uh, you can see here the the API gateway information is already begin, been given. And uh, in case if you want to get the API doc, you can just click here in the link. It will take you to the API Explorer. And what we need is we needed this coin list. You can see down here. So we can just click on try it out. Okay application query is session and execute it after that it will be able to provide you a certain code using that code query you will be able to pull out all your crypto information but please take note uh, they have some file size restrictions uh, uh, there's a prompt here we'll click on a wait so there is a file size and time restriction on a free version of API calls. So I think with this uh, setting, you can only pull out maximum 250, uh, top 250 coins information. So let's get started. I think we already have let that uh, code um, generate. Uh, in the meantime, we will start configuring it in our Excel sheet and uh, you can see here this is the API we are going to call it and the API information is already there here you can see here so we just need to copy okay come to this Excel sheet file all right okay then go to data and then we are going to pull out from our web and you have to click on coin list and click okay so in the meantime is trying to contact the API gateway and trying to pull out the information you can see here it's already connecting it okay so okay so these are the record information which we have already uh, uh, it's pulling out from API so now let's move on to our thing uh, so we have up to here we have already given and now you can see click to the table convert the data into a table format so we are going to convert this data into a table format so yeah we will click here okay uh, none show as an error click okay so now we have uh, data here converted into table so let's move on convert it into table you can see here we are here now now we have to run certain queries so you will need to expand the column so this is the uh, column which we are going to expand as well as in order for the data to be displayed nicely so uh, yeah we are also going to expand the column here by clicking this okay id symbol and name so now you can see that id symbol names has been pulled out already so we are here now close 
and load the data to the spreadsheet uh, excel spreadsheet so we are going to close and load the data into our spreadsheet you can see now this token information has been generated so these are uh, the symbol token ids and token name which we pull out from uh, which has been pulled out from CoinGecko api now we are here okay now it's time to uh, have some queries uh, so close the load uh, close to load the table which we have done it already now we'll go to this option choose the cell which you wish to load the data to so we are going to uh, this is the cell which we are going to load the data okay so now we are going to select top 250 coins here and by importing the data uh, I can select the table row here uh, row and column I'm going to start with uh, this a different sheet and I'm showing the I'm showing the cell number is a1 and click OK as you can see now all the 250 datas are populated here okay so almost 250 we are able to import okay so uh, this is how we uh, create a API configurations uh, in Excel sheet and uh, I, I save this out and uh, book two for your for future reference and now I'm going to share with you guys something which I have already created for you guys so this is the excel sheet let me make it bigger so that okay so this is the excel sheet which i have already created for you guys there is a uh, api integrations already there you have to ensure that if you are using any microsoft excel which is older than 2016 you ensure that uh, you install the Power Query. This tab should be exist. If this tab is not existing, it means the Power Query is not there. But when you are using um, Excel 2016 and above, by default it will come. And you can see I've already uh, populated the two top 250 coins here. Okay, so top uh, 250 coins are already here, and now I can you can see my portfolio. I have created it. Whatever the tokens which I am holding it. Uh, nothing uh, rocket science guys just use this table and if you are holding some other token what you need to do is you just need to replace this with uh, um, uh, your your favorite token uh, I just show you here uh, just talk about ethereum okay I just copy this ETH I come to here and I type this ETH okay current price is this much okay uh, once you change this e eth it's automatically taking it from here okay purchase i just i want to show that i purchase uh, purchase price you can you can whatever the purchase price you want to uh, key in you can just put um, maybe i just put 2000 this is my purchase price and amount unit uh, which I have purchased so I just put one okay so Okay, so this is my gain 746 so like this you can change your tokens the moment you will change the token the price will automatically take it you just need to ensure that you are using these codes if you are if you are if you are changing this uh, I just give you an, another example right cake I am just replacing with BNB see the price automatically take it from the VLOOKUP is already configured here and how many BNB I'm holding it I'm holding it four BNBs okay 
and my unit price uh, at the time which I purchased was uh, 350 okay you just need to key in uh, these three informations what is the token uh, purchase price and unit so unit will be four unit uh, four unit sorry four unit and then purchase price is uh, just take an example that I purchased in 300 so whatever the um at the time of purchase uh, whatever the price was you had to key in here put this and and uh, and just need to give how many coins you have purchased it so it will it will show you your profit and loss uh, what is the percentage you gain it and uh, what is your percentage uh, what is your actual amount which you have earned it or which you are in gain that that will show you here so it's pretty straightforward guys I think uh, it's not about just investing you should also track your portfolio and uh, keep it uh, ready for your further analysis and to track what is your percentage gain and percentage loss and then only you will be further forecasted and you can see every month by month what is your profit and loss ratios so this helps to track your entire portfolio and uh, yeah that's it and do let me know if you want this excel sheet uh, join our telegram group where i have already shared the link to download it and if you are uh, if you want directly to download it i'll just give you a link here just log in to rootzones.net once you log into rootzones.net come to resource once you click on a resource just click here in download you'll be able to download my copy of excel sheet and you can use it for your uh, your portfolios or your portfolio tracking so that's it for the video guys and hope you enjoy the video and if you really like it if it's added some kind of value uh, to your knowledge uh, do consider subscribing our channel and uh, like our contents and if you have any questions uh, please uh, feel free to reach out to us so that's all for the video see you in the next video till then take care bye bye